here in Morristown, Tennessee. Starting off on 265 foot hole one, we're gonna hand it to Rockville, Tennessee, Logan Bowers. Woo! Next up, as you saw, end of the sponsored Logan Bowers. Uh, looks like Logan's lining up for a flick. I always think he's going for a lefty hyzer, but it's actually going with a flick here. Nice soft flick, he's asking it to get up. Got some good skip. Yeah. Logan had a great shot with some skip. Very scary putt and he's able to make the birdie. That's a good birdie. Great way to start the turn. Two, 535 foot par four. This is a crush. It's uphill. You start uphill and you end up uphill. <laughs> mm -hmm. It's kind of a little bit of a valley you're throwing over. These guys are just going to be ripping one as far as they can, trying to get up close to the pin. It's a good shot from Logan. Near the basket, he should have no problems with that. No. Logan didn't really take his time, just tossed it up. Uh, he landed higher up on the hill where Brandon did. Uh, you can actually have par, but as the tournament director and course designer's rules, that's a birdie. Hole number three, 445 feet. These guys are gonna to wanna to hyzer around uh, the tree that you see down in the middle of the screen. Big bulk of trees there. Logan definitely going to the hyzer shot. Trying to get in that open space between those two trees. He mm -hmm. came up a little bit shorter than he wanted. Yeah, he was in the inside, a bit inside. That's a tough angle. Definitely. Logan flicking it up towards the pin. Mm. Almost puts it in for it. He's a really good guy. These two guys you see on the screen here, Zach and Logan, we've done a Pro vs. Joe videos with both of these guys, so make sure you check. Moving on to hole number four, it's a 310 foot par three. Uh, plays uphill for most of the fairway. A little bit of flat area at the first, and it flattens out on top, but this is definitely an uphill hyzer. Logan going with the wide hyzer route. A little bit of skip, and that's he a, is absolutely that's parked. Hard, Let's see that again. I thought this was a little too wide at first, but it's perfect. Look at that. Smooth, clean release. I'm assuming he hit this line in practice over and over. He knew exactly what he was doing. He's got it right beside it and walk away with a three. Logan tapping hand for his beautiful birdie. Logan, great drive, and he's able to definitely trying to make a charge towards first place. Moving on, hole number five, 345 foot, absolute tunnel shot here. Oh yeah. You've got some trees in your way though of that tunnel. A lot has uh, grown up in the past few years. Uh, fairway used to be a lot wider, but it's grown up. Sometimes you get a roll away on that, and, mm -hmm. but he didn't. Good layup. Sit. <laughs> See, he, he even right there watched, watched to make sure it didn't roll. <laughs> Logan tapping in for three here. Four down through five holes now. Dickerson sitting at 37 down now, moving on to hole number six, 290 foot shot. Uh, this is going to be one of your lefty holes. Um, it's kind of downhill and the basket to the right. If you can hit the gap. It likes to carry pretty close to the hole, mm -hmm. as long as you hit that gap. Definitely. Uh, Logan uh, off the side, showing a little frustration there. I mean, it's a tough shot. Mm -hmm. Very great run from Zach, though. See if Logan can get his birdie. It's a great drive from Logan. And he does. Five down through six holes. That's, that's nice. That is a great way to start. But he hit a tree, he didn't hit one. <laughs> <laughs> Moving on to hole number seven, 340 foot, another lefty hole. There is a big uh, right hyzer uh, out around the right side there. It's a little grown up this year. Mm -hmm. though. Logan's opting for the flick down the middle. Mm -hmm. Logan has one of the strongest forehand games I've seen in the game. We're seeing some good shots. A lot Absolutely. of backtracks today. It's actually the first time we've had 
two backtracks in a row on a video. So great to see back to back backtracks. You want for three? Oh. Mm. You had the chance, Logan. Give us three. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's a tough putt right there. Love to see that focus on his face, really taking his time. Mm. Now he'd been shooting a hot round so far, so he really wanted that. Yeah. This hole, he took advantage of it. <laughs> Logan tapped in four down through seven holes. Moving on to hole number eight, he yeah. knocked off a lot of distance there. It doesn't look like he's trying that hard, but he's getting quite a bit of distance. Absolutely. Now Logan, Logan. Woo, flip up. Now this is going to get some, it's got some legs on it. That is an absolute crush right there. There you go. Mm -hmm. For so, these guys to have a chance for a throw in, a look like for second Logan. shot. Yeah, absolutely. That is an absolute crush. I'm pretty it's sure. crazy that it's an easy birdie for these pros, <laughs> you know? <laughs> absolutely. But, hey, that's why. Another par four on the scorecard. 450 uh, feet yeah. that out you can see Brandon playing uh, Cherokee Park again yeah <laughs> <laughs> I like this hole it's really interesting the, the layout of it the, the valley you have to go over mm -hmm. and where you start off uphill and everything it's it's a, interesting but it should be a par 3 yeah Logan with a couple disc changes there he settled on this one and let's see, he lands on the side of the hill there. He's yeah. got to put, see what Logan can do. Hopefully he can get something back from hole number seven. And absolutely able to make the eagle putt. I know these guys are thinking birdie on that, but uh, well, we're starting off this back nine on hole number 10, 485. Yeah, it's, it's pretty far if you're leaning this that tree. Mm -hmm. Next up, we've got in of a sponsored Logan Bowers, 1,005 rated. rated. I saw he did that left hand backhand again. Yeah, it looks like he's going for a left hand backhand when he sets up a sidearm. No surprise to see him with a sidearm here. He's got a ton of power. One of my favorite sidearms in the game. Absolutely great shot. He's up by the pin, so you shouldn't have any problems with that. Logan looking for a two here. Pin high on your drive. It's mm -hmm. crazy. Absolutely. You just have to see this hole in person to know how crazy that is. Mm -hmm. These guys are making it look a whole lot easier than it is. I know you hear that a lot in disc golf coverage, but i got to be honest, and i got to tell you that it's they make it look a lot easier. Ooh, a little bit. I'm yeah, he's kicking himself after that one. Mm -hmm. Good tap in, birdie for Logan. This one is a par four on the scorecard. Moving on to hole number 11, 290 foot par three. Didn't even look like he was trying. Mm -mm. Logan, once again, no surprise to see him going to the flick. Absolutely love to watch his flick. So smooth. Oh, unfortunately hits those limbs. Gets knocked down early. He's still in there. He's still mm -hmm. got a jump basket. So it's gonna be an easy par. This is a very tuable hole. I've actually heard this one being aced before. But uh, very tuable, but you have to stay clean on your drive. Mm. Really have to. Oh, yeah. Uh, Dickerson's uh, going to make him chase him down. He's not going to give it up. Oh, unfortunate. Oh. Off the chains for Logan. Oh, man. It's got to hurt when he's trying to chase Dickerson down here. Mm. Good comebacker there. This is a tunnel shot right down the middle of the fairway. If you can get out of the small fairway. It's going to be a scary shot for Logan here, knowing after he missed that last hole. He's definitely going to try and get out as far as he can. Very clean. Really far up the fairway. That's a great shot from Logan right there. He's going to have a jump. He knows. Mm -hmm. You get that close on this hole. You want to capitalize. Uh, definitely. I'd love to see Logan really stepping up. He didn't feel comfortable once. Step back, take his time, make sure he's ready to make the putt. See what he can do with it here. It's all about getting his focus, and I love that. 
Oh, I like how the car in the background stopped while he was there. can kind of get in your head because you know it's uh, should be an easy shot and sometimes that makes you think a little less of it. Moving on to hole number 13. Spoiler alert, this is going to be a short one. <laughs> <laughs> like I said, it's such a blast filming Zach. Logan with the hyzer, very soft release there. And you can see all these guys are going to be the downhill putt. Sometimes yeah. these get in your head as well. This is a little bit steeper than it looks mm -hmm. on film. Yeah, and I have seen that exact kind of putt right there miss and roll down. And then you have a good star frame there from everybody. Here's the long one. Hole number 14, 600. Good shot right there. He's going to be looking at about maybe 200 feet from the basket there. Logan. Gonna be getting a long run up here. Going with a roller. Well, I was wondering if somebody would. Hmm. This is a typical roller hole, trying to get as much distance. He's heading towards the OB. That needs to slow down. Oh, he just turned around, he knew oh. it. Don't run over his disc, okay? <laughs> Unfortunately, he's gonna take an OB stroke uh. there. But he did manage to make it, so I think he wanted to turn a little bit more, but that's a good shot. Bowers with a flick. He should be up there near the basket. His loaf. Can't really see. I think he was laying that one up there. Try making sure he wasn't getting the roll away. See what Logan can do here. Mm. Mm. A little low and left. <laughs> <laughs> Logan's uh, it did skip down a little bit. Thankfully it didn't roll. Mm. Oh unfortunately. Mm. The OB stroke and two missed putts. He's going to be taking a high number on this hole, and that's not what he wants this late in the tournament. Moving on to hole number 15, 360 feet, but not too bad. There's uh, a little gravel walkway up there that you want to try and make it to and across and for a little putting green. Oh, mm. unfortunate tree kick from Logan there. Looking like a little... Hyzer forehand here, getting around the tree. Good Outstanding, up. yeah. Both of those hurt. Mm. No, we Logan got... with a little tap in. Yeah, these are these are not really sped out baskets. These, are, these mm -hmm. guys are just having baskets. Necessary, it isn't necessarily a a two that most people are going to be another two from Dickerson there. As long as he doesn't get a spit out like we saw in the last basket. Can't guarantee nothing today, I don't guess. <laughs> Logan going with the flick. Probably going to hang it out wide. He does. Maybe a little wider than... No, nope. oh, let's turn it back. Must have been something real yeah. stable because he had that turned over. Yeah, he knew what it was going to do. It's a great shot from Logan. Logan tapping in. And as long as Chris stays in here, we've got another star frame. Dickerson's stretching out his lead. He's at 45 down now. Moving on to hole number seven. It's just a funky hole if you ever get to play in real life. Mm -hmm. Funky looking. <laughs> it's definitely a reachable hole for these pros. Uh, I myself have landed uh, closer than I ever thought I would to that basket. And these guys can definitely reach it. I know when I first played Cherokee Park, I thought this was an unreachable hole. But yeah. the arms on these guys, it's just amazing to see the holes they can reach. And Logan, great shot. Actually passed the basket. Yeah. Hopefully sure. Mark caught that one on the second cam because I mm -hmm. didn't get behind Brandon in time. So thanks, Mark, for catching Downhill that. Downhill putt here. Mm -hmm. uh, this can be has very much potential to roll. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, oh, stands up. Sorry, Logan. I called it. <laughs> Griffin's never seen this footage, so he actually didn't know that was happening. There. Sorry, Logan. I called it. <laughs> We just sit down and stop making me feel bad. Okay. Oh, that oh. rolled all the way to the bottom. Very unfortunate roll away. He was chasing Dickerson down on the front nine. Maybe mm. himself another downhill putt, but that's all any day. Uh, Logan, another putt here after that unfortunate roll away. Great. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Great to see him make that one.
hole left to play in the tournament. Hole 18, 455 foot par four. Look like Logan's uh, wanting to take some aggression out after that roll away from the last hole. He's really backing up on this one. Gets a rip on it. A lot of turn. Oh, looks like maybe a little bit too much turn. Oh, got too aggressive. OB, unfortunately. Playing it from where it went out there. He's got a putt, but it will be for a three. Mm. Mm. Being off. Hopefully Logan can make his comebacker here. No problems from him. Looks a little disappointed, but he's a young. Oh, I'm just so dynamic. On another latitude, they can't stand it. Yeah, I'm a rocket boy. I stay blasting off, and I was never planning on landing. I've been working on my legacy yeah. since I've been a prodigy. It's probably the dog in me. I mean, honestly, ain't no one stopping me. No apologies. I'm so astonishing. I say, Innova, yeah, I've been the one. We talking trophies, dog, give me them. Championships, I'ma give me some, and I'ma keep on grinding till the millions come.